What is up YouTube? Rick here, aka Norcal Collector. We have another Top Shot pack opening today. And this time I was able to get three times my money back from today's pack. So before we go to that, there is a new pack coming out, Hustle and Show. This pack is going to drop May 3rd. So hopefully we can get in to buy this pack. So some pack details. So each pack will contain five cards, uh, one common hustle and show, and four common series two base sets. And the limited edition common uh, drops consists of eight different hustle and show uh, moments. And they're numbered to 18,000. So uh, you can probably make a good amount of money from these packs. So there is a pack requirement. You need to own at least two moments so if you are new to top shot uh, you can log in and make an account you can purchase two moments at the marketplace for four or five dollars uh, there are a lot of debates going on if top shot is still worth getting into people need to remember it is still on the beta phase it has a big support from the nba and its players so so if you ask me yes it, it's still worth it Whenever there is a drop in packs, I would definitely recommend buying them. You can still make money. Probably not as much as when it first started, but you can definitely still get your money's worth. So, having said that, let's open another pack. Again, this is a $9 pack. Even if you get the worst players, you can still sell each for each card for 4 or $5. So our first card is a common, a brown, I'm not sure what his first name is from the Nets. So not a good card. Uh, this will probably sell for uh, 4 or $5. Dollars. So next card is another common, it's uh, Blake Griffin, so from the Nets, uh, but this one is from when he was still with the Pistons, a good a hook shot or a baby hook. So I was hoping maybe for a Durant or Harden, those sell for a good amount of money. Uh, but this card is actually a limited edition, so this one sold for $23, so not bad. It was numbered out of 12000 that's why it sold for a higher price. And our last card is a block from Sabonis, from the Pacers. Uh, he's an all-star, but he doesn't really command too much attention so this will probably sell for four or five dollars as well anyway uh, not bad for a nine dollar pack so I sold all three cards for thirty two dollars and I did spend seven dollars to buy a Russell Westbrook card so I'm going to show you my uh, some of my top shot moments. So these are the cards that I, I'm just keeping in my account. First is a uh, KP uh, Kristaps Porzingis card. I'm not a big fan of him, but I kept him. I kept this card because of a uh, baby goat Luca. If you follow my channel, I collect Luca rookie cards. Uh, Luca does have a common moment currently being sold for $24. Uh, that moment he was also doing an assist, so this is the cheaper version of that card, of that of that moment. So next is uh, Joel Embiid. This is one of my earlier cards. One of the best centers in the game. MVP candidate for this season. Most likely, uh, Nikolai Jokic will win MVP. 
but just to show you how much prices have gone down, this same card was sold for $2,000 when Top Shot first came out. And currently it's selling for around $11, which is a fair price. But can you imagine being the person who bought this card for $2,000? And uh, next is Mr. Triple Double, Russell Westbrook. So I mentioned I bought this card for $7. And I hit this guy's underrated four triple doubles in the season in his career. And only lacking is a championship game. So and who knows, he might eventually join the Lakers and get this ring. 